Hello, I'm Professor Bill Keevil. I'm Professor of Environmental Health Care at the University of Southampton in the School of Biological Sciences. Our interest in penny copper bottles arose from the fact that copper has been known as a beneficial agent for health for thousands of years. So it was used by the ancient Egyptians, the ancient Chinese, and also very importantly in India. And 5,000 years ago, they developed Ayurveda medicine. And part of that was the concept of Tamra Jal. And Tamra Jal effectively is copper water. And the practice was that you would put drinking water into a copper vessel, leave it overnight, and then you would drink it the next day. And it was believed to have many health-giving properties not least reducing infection from drinking contaminated water. So we thought, well, could we get the same effect with penny bottles? Our studies have shown that drinking water stored in penny bottles is rapidly purified and we get more than 99.9% .9 reduction of fecal E. coli and the superbug Klebsiella pneumoniae. So this work shows that penny bottles have got this very beneficial property of purifying water, certainly within 24 hours. So over the past 10 years or so, there's suddenly been a big spurt in a number of health studies investigating why copper is beneficial. Uh, it's quite a magic element, in fact. It's required for a range of important enzymes in the body, um, it can reduce inflammation, um, it can reduce reactive oxygen species which cause a lot of damage and are also related to the inflammation. Water is very important to most of life on this planet. So for humans we need at least two litres of drinking water a day. If you exercise, for example, through your work or through your leisure activities, you need more. So it's important to have bottle materials which are good at inactivating bacteria and viruses. One of the reasons why people uh, adopted the use of stainless steel, it looks nice and shiny and therefore it's believed to be clean but we know it's got no antimicrobial properties at all. Now, when people look at copper, they say, but it tarnishes. When I see copper tarnishing, I'm quite pleased because I know it's producing the copper ions we need to kill pathogens. When we consider uh, using copper as a touch surface or as a, a holder for drinking water, we've done extensive studies looking at various plastics and stainless steel they do not show any antimicrobial properties at all. So clearly it's very beneficial if you want to have water storage um, to consider using a penny bottle rather than use a plastic bottle or a stainless steel bottle.